you know yeah. how many married women are single mothers? I don't, but. Uh, whoa. whoa. Ooh, get into wow. it. Get into it. Get into married it. women are single. Yeah, yeah. How does someone out here? I'll give you this explanation. Okay. I'm not, because me and my husband actually work together on raising our kids. Mm -hmm. But there is plenty of households where a woman is solely responsible for raising kids, and, and a man don't give and up. You, and you define those women as single mothers. A married woman as a single mom, yeah. Oh, I, I, would, I mean, it's legally, yeah, legally, no. Yeah. But in reality, if if you're a man, and I mean, your household run how your household run. But if you can't help your wife or your girl out with the kids, and you know she need a break, or What's up, y'all? This controversial Shannon. If you hear some noise in the background, I'm on the truck yard. Just got off work. I drive trucks. Now that that's out the way, did she lie, though? Did she lie, though? She not lying because, you know, oftentimes what we hear amongst guys is that they want their wife to be just a homemaker. And they don't understand that sometimes women lose their identity and just taking care of them goddamn kids and being stuck in that goddamn house. Don't matter how much money you make or what you think going what you think you're doing outside to provide and all that, that's your job. That's your job. And it's also part of your job to be part of your kid's life. Right? It's also part of your job to help out around the house. I don't understand why chores is... <laughs> we're talking about chores. This is something adults do. Yeah, this is something children do. I'm sorry. Uh, to where you can't even help, help around the house that y'all both live in. You can't take away some of the stress that she's going through and and don't even get me started if you're in a situation where both of y'all are working and then we're expecting her to come home cook clean and take care of them kids you are out of your mind you are out of your mind half the half the dudes that be talking about the woman need to do this you're not even a traditional man you're not even a traditional man you don't make six figures so what are you talking about but even when it comes to those dynamics, a woman still wants you to work. Or, I mean, to do something around the house. Something as simple as taking out the goddamn trash. If you see some dishes that need to be clean, put them up. Put them up. Because I know about situations where a woman will do everything in the house. Everything in the house and the kids. And one little thing is not spotless and the dude snaps. Why you why you do that right there? Why I thought I told you that. Next thing you know, the, the dude putting hands on him. Just stupid, just dumb situations. But we not, we're not gonna go to that extreme. We're not gonna go to that extreme. But there is no way that our wives, right, should be feeling this way. If you see something that need to be done around the house, you do it. Don't ask her why it didn't get done. Especially if both of y'all are in a or both of y'all are working. Especially if both of y'all are working, nah, bro. You can't be, you cannot expect a woman to to have intercourse with you as a man, like it's no tomorrow. Clean up the house and be working and take care of them kids. You out your mind. You out your mind. I wonder how many marriages could have been saved if the men would put a little bit more effort into into everything. What if I told you that a lot of y'all are just... Never mind. Women get bored, bro. You don't want a bored woman and an unhappy woman. Those are two combinations that you don't want. So don't sign up for this thing called marriage if you're not built for it. If you're not built for it. Women commit 80% of the divorce. Have you ever looked into why they divorce? <laughs> never mind. So what I'm trying to say is that women are not... They're not magicians, bro. Or they're not God. They can't just do everything. Snap of a finger, bro. They're human. Help out. So I'm so as as brothers, bro, we can do a little bit more to empathize and sympathize with what some of these women are saying. Now, now not the extreme uh things, right? Not the extreme things. We're not rationalizing with no no idiocracy over here. We not no. But we could do a better job at listening and the truth of the matter is women want a little bit of help around the house women want a little bit of help with the kids women get tired too these dudes be out here worried about a home cooked meal when the last time you cooked for your wife but anyway
Y'all have a good one. Y'all stay safe. Y'all be blessed. In Jesus' name.